<laughs> he did jump. Hi, folks. I'm Larry Ladowski, and today I'm down in El Salto, Mexico, fishing out of Anglers Inn International. I'm fishing with Paul Davis of Abu Garcia Fish and Tackle. And we're not only going to hopefully catch some giant bass today, but we're going to talk to Paul about rod and reels and what makes a rod and reel help you put better, more fish in the boat. So stick with us. We're going to catch some fish and have some fun. There we go. And there's another one. <laughs> it's almost every cast, Paul. <laughs> Ooh, taking some drag on you. This might be a decent one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you net yours. I'll just kind of hang on to mine here. <laughs> <laughs> so we're fishing these new Veritas rods. How are you liking oh, these for I'm, crankbaits? I'm, I think it's terrific. Winch series. It's a little bit feisty. Good fish. So we're fishing this uh, the new Veritas 2.0. And what we added is uh, a couple of winch series models, and those are cranking specific re uh, rods. So before we had two, now we've expanded that. Um, this in particular is the 7.11.7, which is perfect for these big crankbaits. We've changed up a few things. We've kept uh, the Veritas the way it used to be. Um, the cosmetics look similar to the old one, but the inside of it is where everything has changed. We put a spiral carbon core, and basically what that is is a filament of carbon fiber that runs throughout, from butt to tip, the inside wall of this rod. And what that does, it's like a garden hose. If you think of a garden hose and it's open like that and you bend it, it'll kink. With having that filament in there, it doesn't allow it to kink, and we increase brake strength, overall brake strength on average 22%, and then tip strength by 30% across the whole series. It's the other nice thing about these rods, too, you can hoist the fish right in. Big fish. See him yet? Big fish. There he is. Ah, he's not that big. He's decent. He felt a lot bigger than he was. Ooh, it's coming up quick. All right, Paul, so we covered, covered rods. Reels, there's so many out there. What goes into the design of a reel? So we've got so many different ones. We've got you know, standard reels that can be used for a variety of techniques. And then you've also noticed that we've got some reels that are very specific as well. Um, for example, right now we're throwing the winch. Uh, works really well for crankbaits. That's what it's designed for. It's a low gear ratio. Uh, makes it easy to, to turn, pull these big crankbaits, pull those big fish in, like a winch on a truck. It's got the, the, the power got the to do torque. it. Yep, it's got the torque. Um, this year we came out with the beast, which we've been fishing earlier. Uh, it's sort of like the winch, but it's just beefier. It's got a higher gear, gear ratio, so when you get fish in these, this thick cover, you can just really just get them out and you want that faster speed so you can just leverage them out of the, the, uh, the trees. 22 pounds of max drag, things like that to just really make that reel a tank. And I'm sure one of the best parts is going out and testing these new rods and reels, especially if you can get down to El Salto and test it on some of these huge bass. Whoever brings their tackle down here, you put it to the test. I mean, you really do. When you're wrapped up in a tree like that or you're trying to pull a nine pound bass around you know, a ledge, it's it's awesome. It's, it's the perfect proving ground. Oh, yeah. He's going to jump in the boat. <laughs> Switched up the spinner bait. Throwing it on this beast reel. So we came across that point, cast it with this beast reel. If he gets into the trees, I can winch him right out. Easy to do with these big knobs and big handle. Get a lot of leverage on this fish. What a day. We got a front coming in, so we're gonna head into the lodge here. I wanna thank Paul Davis and Abu Garcia Fishing for having us down to El Salto. I also wanna thank Anglers Inn International, as well as our terrific guide, Juan, for, for all the work he's done today. Remember, pay attention to your gear. It's the little things that'll help you land more fish in the boat. Whatever you're fishing for, make sure you match the gear for it. I'm Larry Ladowski, catch you later. Hey.